Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're doing something different today. Uh, this is uh, The Phantom Eye, and the name of the song is Ease the Pain. Um, we think this guy suggested to me a while back. I was going through my list here of a whole bunch of different songs to try to come up with some new stuff to add to the channel to blend into the mix here. And I have this one here, so I think at some point somebody suggested it or something. Um, so we're going to check it out. Uh, I have no idea what we're getting into. I've never heard this before. I don't know the group, so um, fuck it. Phantom Eye, ease the pain. Let's check it out. <laughs> So far, this is pretty cool. Definitely digging it. It's a very chill vibe, you know what I mean? But it looks like it could go either which way. It could just be chill the rest of the way. It might just fucking rock out. But I'm liking it so far. It's very, you just got like a, it seems like it has a nice build up going, but doesn't necessarily mean that it's building up to something crazy or wild. Or, you know, it could be something smooth too, you know? So I'm liking it. So let's check it out and see where it goes. <laughs>
cool track. Definitely enjoyed that. I had wasn't too heavy. I had like a nice like hard edge to it at some points, but then it was also like very chill at the same time. Like it didn't like have to like go too wild, too crazy, but like enough to fit the song. You know what I mean? Like the like just the whole ambience of the song it just it just works really well. It was a really fucking awesome track. That couple parts kind of gave me like a little bit of like a like a clutch vibe. Not fully, like, but like a little bit, like kind of, I don't know. It, it, it's just kind of like the feel that I got a little bit at some parts, but it was a uh, fucking good track, though. I definitely enjoyed it. A um, little bit of a side note. Uh, when I was watching the video there, um, I was looking, I'm like, I recognize the drummer. Um, like, at first, I'm like, he looks familiar, and then, like, I recognized who he was. Then I remembered how I came about doing uh, this song and video and whatnot for uh, reaction. The drummer played in both Nassau Chainsaw and Neck, um, drums and Neck, and sang in Nassau Chainsaw. And a friend of mine was also in Nassau Chainsaw as well. And a while back, he had posted this on his Facebook page and was like, people, you got to check this out. It's really cool, this and that. And I was like... Oh yeah, that's um, Larry from Neck and Nassau Chainsaw. That's his new project. You know what he was uh, explaining it in like the details in the Facebook post and whatnot. So I was like, you know, that'd probably be a good song to do a reaction for. And I wrote it down a while back, and I didn't make a note of who it was or where I got that uh, suggestion from. Though it wasn't a suggestion, I decided to do it on my own. But I didn't make a note of that, so I had completely forgotten that's what that was. So when I was going through my list of songs to put up today, I was like, oh, I don't remember where this was from. Someone probably suggested along the way on the channel here, but that's actually not the case. That was actually something I decided to look into on myself. Uh, something I decided to look into on my own. And, uh, yeah, this is really cool. Definitely enjoyed this. So uh, If you guys did too, let me know. Um, I'm going to try... Yeah. I'm going to look around as well and see if there's some other songs uh, to check out. Um, if you are aware of them, definitely let me know what songs you think I should check out next. And, uh, yeah, we'll put it up on the channel here for sure. This is really cool. Definitely enjoyed this a lot. If you enjoyed the video too, make sure you hit the thumbs up down below. Subscribe to the channel if you, do eh. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you on the next video.